Okay, I'm gonna teach you how to make a uh, pulpit on in 3D Max 2008. Here it is. Not a very good pulpit, but you know it, it works, I guess. If you're putting it a game. Okay, so let's get started. Alright, first, start with the box. Oh yeah, well, let's do it like that. Mm, make it about that high. Then, right click it. Oh, some people can't right click it. They're on tutorials and stuff because of their camera. So if you can't, if you're going to make a tutorial on how to make a better little bit, you go over to this right here. And click modified, click, type in E on your keyboard, and go down to editable poly. Edit poly, actually. Um, click this one, click the top, go down to see extrude, and click it and extrude it up a little. Maybe even lower than that, but I'm gonna use that. Um, click the shirt again to turn it off. Then select that and hold control. Um, my screen, is my, mo my camera monitor is too heavy for the camera, so I don't have a tripod or keep it up. Oh, and press Control R to rotate. And make sure you hold Control on all of them. Okay, they're all selected. And uh, I think you have to select the top too. And rotate it. Whichever way you want to look to it, like that. Yeah, kind of like we got that done. Yeah, it's not a very good pulpit. Um, now, thank you. Okay. So, like this. Edges, yeah, edge. Don't forget about holding control. Oh. You know, I forgot to tell you how to click that. <laughs> Hopefully you know how to click it. Okay. And press connect once both edges are selected right here. Connect is... Down here. And you should get one line in the center and I think you can actually I really don't know how to do it so I gotta rotate and you could probably slide it down but I don't know how to do it for those of you who know how to do it whatever I gotta do that and then go down okay yeah um oops I didn't think it would take this long. Okay. Um, click this. And extrude it out. Extrude. Ugh. If you make a mistake like that, just press Ctrl Z. Are extruded. Um, I had to make that cross. We're almost done here. Okay, and mm, and hold and click rotate up here. Hold. 
hold shift, which is uh, the camera down. And hold shift and rotate. And you should get that. You should get this box. Hit put it on copy. Um. And just move it up a little. I think that's good. And then select them both by doing that. You might get a circle select, so to change it to a square like this one. Change it to a square select. A circle mess up a lot. Hold this till you get that and change it to this one. Um, okay, select them both and rotate them to the cross. I mean to the pulpit. Rotate it. Oh, well, I can't get a straight one. I'll fix it later. But, you know, right now. And to connect them, once you get them touching each other. Okay, I'm just going to connect it like this. I know it's not the best cross. Or it even looks good, but once you get yours, um, select it all like that. Go to Group, Assemble, and click Assemble. You get a message. Name it whatever you want, and Assemble. And now, once you click that, it now moves together my other one and that's how you make it thanks for watching